Welcome to The Nail Engineer and um, this week we've got Bess aka Lady Hands who you might recognise from my hollow video, she had some nice pink hollow um, but no hollow today but it is holiday time so uh, Beth is going to Morocco and so she wanted something kind of like blue and white um, with a bit of glitter of course so what we've got on Beth today is we have got two coats of this lovely colour here which is Madame Glam in Lagoon and we are going to be stamping over white in a variety of styles which I'll go over later and on two fingers she wants this beautiful glitter from Magpie which is Cousin Rachel's favourite and she's called Bluebell and she is gorgeous. She's got blue tones and green tones and basically when it's on your nails it's like that colour that you get on blue bottle flies sometimes blue sometimes green but much more pretty than flies. Beth has got um, these three fingers already top coated um, but I've left these two with just the tacky inhibition layer of the lagoon colour into which I can use my trusty brush to press some lovely glitter. So as per usual I've got my takeaway menu or junk mail something shiny made of shiny paper with a crease down the middle so that when you've finished you can decant your excess down the crease, this crease. So I'm just loading up the glitter on Beth's nail, same old same, pressing it in there. And then once you've got full coverage with your kind of huge pile of glitter you can start to really burnish it into the nail so that you get all of the particles laying flat going in the same direction so that it comes up super shiny just like that. So I'm going to do the other nail, top coat, and then we'll come back for some stamping fun. Okay, so Beth is all cured up and glittered now, and this is what we're going to need for the stamping. And apologies, but I have no idea who manufactures this. I'll put a link. I bought it as part of a bundle on eBay, um, but we're going to be using this image right here. And we're going to be using Moyu Punk Collection Plate number 10 and just this pattern here and then this great big massive one which again I don't know who the manufacturer is because it was a present and we're going to use this one right here with Esmaldi's de Kelly white stamping polish called Dolly and a trusty little scraper and my clear jelly stamper or if the images won't pick up as they won't in a couple of cases I'll use good old Big Blue who's my sticky squishy jumbo stamper. So we're just going to get on stamping uh, Beth now and first up I'm going to be using the Moyu punk plate and just this little image here Not too much, because Beth's got tiny little dolly fingers. She's too afraid to say anything. <laughs> and see, that picks up really nice with Big Blue. And just the usual thing. Make sure you've got a good part of the design lined up. Squish that in and then just take care to roll it off slowly so that you don't get any of the excess going back onto the nail and ruining your design. And there it is. And as per, you just take a cocktail stick. Ta-da! And just break the seal around the edge 
because you don't want to get any of this excess caught on there when you put your top coat on. You want a nice clean edge all the way around the nail. Okay, so now we'll move on to the middle finger and for that we've got this lovely design here. And the great thing about this particular plate, and I'll see if I can find it on eBay, I think I've seen a few listings kicking around for uh, at least a similar one. Great thing about this plate is with the curved bottom there, you can use it as a French tip design, or you can do the half moon design so that you've just got like a little half moon left of, of color on your fingers and the rest stamped. So, on with the polish, swipe down, Roll over, big blue, pick that up, no problem. And then onto the nail. And there you go. Finally, on Beth's thumb, we've got this design here. And again, with this Mar Blues to Kelly, you don't need to use a lot. A little goes a long way. And there it is. And we'll just take care to position it in the centre. And this one has got some really bold lines on it. So you've got to be extra careful when rolling off not to get some of the lines coming back onto the nail. Okay, so I'm just gonna get, na get the nails um, cleaned up around the edges. Top coat twice for stamping because you don't want to risk losing any of that stamp with voids that might appear because you haven't got your tacky inhibition layer for it to really cling to. So that is Beth all cured up and you can see all of her lovely designs if we show you them one by one. So this is the thumb and obviously we've got this lovely, you can't quite see it um, on camera as well as you can in person, that kind of greenish tinge that the Bluebell Magpie Glitter has got but it's gorgeous. And then the middle finger which was from the great big plate and then the little Moyu from the punk plate and who'd have thought that a punk plate would result in these um it's like a spanish kind of tile inspired look for her holidays oh, no.